guys, this is Swimming Spider 4, and today I'm going to be unboxing and reviewing the Nerf Sledgefire. The Sledgefire is a gun that I wanted for a long time, just because how fun it is to use. So let's get into the unboxing straight away, because I'm really excited. So, yeah. The box also states, it has like this cool drawing and art in the back, it also uses shells, which I really like. But I'm going to demonstrate that soon yeah, let me try and get under here and okay there's one more wait I'm trying to okay uh, so yeah now I should be able to take the sledge fire out of the box I hope Oh yeah, one second, this is all connected. Okay, I'm just gonna rip this out. Don't wanna damage anything. Okay. Now I should be able to cut a bit of the sledge file off. So I'm just taking the plastic off the that was holding it in and that's it you've got it out oh this feels so good okay now let's try and explore the box a bit more wait oops already ripped up okay so we're gonna take the box apart like this and here we have the instruction manual and after that we should be able to split this box like that and then safely get out the rival ammo. No! Sorry for that guys, my cat was chewing on the new ammo that I got. So back to re the review. I'm trying to get the green zombie strike ammo out. Sh should just mean taking off the tape, like that. And you just get the whole package out. And then the actual problem of trying to get in. I'm going to try and do it safely, but I'm not sure I can... Yeah, I think I can just cut through it, wait. What? Yeah. Okay, like so. And that should be me opening the nine dots, the nine zombie strike green dots coming out one two three yep that's nine let's put all of this in the box and put this over to the side now i'm going to show you how to operate this nerf gun first you take out the shells the, there are three included which is cool and we can put the sludge fire to the side now take the zombie strike ammo and slide it to the very bottom of the shell. And there you've got three shells loaded. So you can put that off to the side and there's a sling mount here which yeah this whole thing is a sling mount which is pretty cool and the there's no front one which i find strange there is this one thing here though which i don't know if you can use as a sling mount but it sure looks hard to clip something over that so yeah to operate you push this hammer like thing you crack open the barrel and that also primes the spring you take a shell put it face down into the nerf gun, you flip it up, and shoot. 
So yeah, now on to the firing test. So now I'm going to fire it with the included green zombie stripe dots. Oops. Yeah, this gets quite... This is really hard to get used to, which is one downside. So how to get it out, you just push it down until the spring comes out. And then you can reload it again. So it does take a bit of getting used to, but I haven't really gotten used to the gun as well. So yeah, that's the firing test completed. Overall, this is a very good gun and I'm really happy with it. I'm really happy that I got it for my shotgun class because it's extremely fun to use. You load pretty slowly, but I think after I use it a while, I might get used to it. So yeah, I really like it and that concludes my review. So I hope you enjoyed watching and I'll see you all guys later. Peace.